Hey, what's up, guys? Foxy Dubs coming to you guys today with a brand new video. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Today, it's raining. Actually, it's like super cloudy here over in Maryland. And the weather's bipolar over here. Yesterday, it was like super blistering heat. Humid as hell outside. And I only know that because the only time I really go outside is to let my dog out. So <laughs> yeah, it's been like super hot over here lately. And it's pretty cloudy and things like that today. I don't know. The weather's acting up. Might be a storm of brewing. But today, we are going to be using the brand new rainbow gun in Modern Warfare. I, I cannot stand this game, but you know what? This is a really cool variant. It's a cool blueprint. And there's two blueprints. And you get an operator out of it as well. Actually, I'm going to change my operator real quick. It's a domino skin, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Like, that's, that's dope. Like, look at that. That's dope. Not, like, <laughs> not a lot of people might think it's dope. I think it's pretty cool just because, you know, I just like really cool skins like this. I know it's modern warfare and you're not really going to see anyone in the U.S. military running around with this kind of skin on in what looks to be Crocs. You get blueprints for the M13 and the Odin. We're going to check both of those out. So I hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you guys do, if you guys don't mind dropping a like on the video, it's greatly appreciated. Subscribe to our notifications. I think we're like 25 subscribers away from 125K. If you guys want to do that for me, it'd be greatly appreciated. But I uh, am. Yeah, let's get right into the video. Let's go, bro. Oh, we got the M13 and we got the Odin. Nice, nice. It's beautiful. All right, so I figured that we would play on the new map all a rib just because i am I mean, to be honest with you guys i don't really know what to do oh there's tracers in these too i didn't realize that i don't really pay attention to when i buy this stuff honestly i noticed i just noticed that it was just rainbow stuff and someone in the comments of the other uh the other day asked me to make a video on this and i was like yeah sure i guess and then i figured it was just like the perfect time to do it because uh the new map is out last night i watched the suns game and the suns are going to the nba finals chris paul is going to his first nba finals and I'm pretty sure like 15 years. He's been playing for 15 years and he's never made it to the NBA Finals. And he's finally made it, which is super cool. You know, the way that Chris Paul plays and the way that he flops and everything like that and like is acting all the time when he gets fouled or something like that, that's super annoying to me. But it's just like LeBron. I can't stand or anyone else in the, in, in the NBA. I cannot stand when people do that. It's just super annoying. But... You know, congrats to him. He's had a really long career. He's had some hardships. He's always lost in the playoffs. He's like one of those players. You always put the phrase, they're never going to win a championship next to. And like I said in a couple of videos last week, it's really nice to see new faces in the NBA Finals and things like that. It's really nice to see new players get to the NBA Finals, especially the players that, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? They, they had that... Um, I think, what's that what's that phrase i'm looking for like they had that cloud over their head your trash good come here and they have that trait of them not being able to get to the finals and things like that so it's super nice to see people actually get there and be able to say hey like i actually got to the nba finals and things like that and um he's a fantastic point guard so i can't really complain about you know his how he plays and things like that also, have you guys, like, did they do something to the cruise missile? Because it's super slow now, and it, I feel like it just kind of defeats the purpose of the kill streak. Huh? Wait. <laughs> Wait, how'd I get him? He was just as surprised as I was. He's a fantastic point guard. He's been in the league for so long. I'm pretty sure he entered in the league around, like, 2003, 2004. Maybe it was 2005. I can't remember. But I remember when he played with the Hornets. It's crazy to think he's been on a couple teams as well, but he's never been on, like, one of those teams that has had a super team. I mean, he played for the Clippers when he was with Blake Griffin and um, DeAndre Jordan. And I'm pretty sure Jamal Crawford was on that team as well. I still wouldn't consider that a super team like LeBron, Kyrie, and Kevin Love, or, you know, Steph Curry, Clay Thompson, Kevin Durant. Like th those are what I would consider super team. And even the Nets of this year, Kyrie, KD, and James Harden, I would consider that a super team as well. And I'm pretty, wait, I'm pretty sure that Chris Paul played for the Rockets too, didn't he? Didn't he play with James Harden? And no, wait, no, was that? No, that was Russ. Russ played with James Harden and uh, no, they both did. Russ was on the Thunder and then CP3 was on the Rockets and then they traded, they swapped for one another. So pretty much like Russ went to the Rockets and CP3 went to the Thunder. And then I'm pretty sure this past, this year, the Suns went and got Chris Paul. And for being in the league for like 15 years, Chris Paul has, is just an amazing athlete for sure. He's a great player, 100%. I just don't like how he acts and flops. Like, I just, I can't stand it. It's everyone in the NBA, though, like I said. All right, so like I said the other day, I'm on season two of My Hero Academia, and I'm pretty much, I, I'm pretty really? sure I'm like halfway through. I said that in yesterday's video, and if you guys didn't, you go check that out. We, I mean, well, I mean, I guess you guys don't really have to, because we played on the, uh, we played on the, what's it called, map today. We played on, um, the Al Arab. So uh, I, I just got to the part where they started picking their hero names and that's super cool. I'm actually a little bit past that. That's something I can say without spoiling anything. 
which is nice because I don't like to spoil things for people. Obviously, I don't like to, um, I don't like, I, I don't want to spoil anything if you're going to watch it, you know? I'm fast as fuck, boy. Come get some. <laughs> the anime is really cool. Eric told me that uh, apparently the My Hero Academia fan base uh, likes to say that it's the best anime of all time. And it's kind of kind of toxic like that. Like it's one of the anime fan bases that says it's the best ever and that no one can ever top it. And I'm going to be real with you guys. Like, I don't think so. Obviously, you can think whatever you want and all that stuff. You know, it, for me personally, it's just not one of the best. I mean, it's not one of my favorites. I mean, like I like it. It's dope. But there's just others that I just really enjoy a lot more. If you is one of those if you guys haven't checked out vivi fluorite's eye song or Flo uh, fluorite eyes song you guys need to go check that out like 100 you guys definitely need to but vivi's over but you guys definitely need to i saw jordy 2d tweet about it like i think it was a couple weeks ago and um I, I was just like finally thank you someone actually recognizes the greatness that is vivi all right let's go in here is there anyone over here i think there's a guy right here gotcha bitch and okay there's a shotgun oh, this, this kid is like just literally camping in there with a shotgun he's got stopping power and it's a fire shotgun what is this i need you guys to give me so, a suggestion on what uh what anime to watch next well actually i'm pretty sure i'm gonna watch full metal alchemist brotherhood after i finish my hero it's been on my list for a while and i have wanted to watch it for a pretty long time i'd say uh it was actually one of my one of the ones that was recommended to me the most recently and then after that i don't really know what i'm gonna dive into to be honest i feel like by the time i kind of finish those well see the thing about me is i kind of finished anime in about like a week a week or two uh, naruto and naruto shippuden took me about or shippuden whatever you want to however you want to say it that took me about a month to finish both of those but see i binged the hell out of those that was around like november december where i stopped really streaming as much on twitch let me know what you guys think about uh me streaming uh on twitch for like halo content and things like that i really want to to be honest i, I don't really know think about that but i just kind of want to have fun i'm also trying to work on a couple other projects and things like that try and get some things in the works as well we got we got that coming up this guy is 22 and 0 23 and 0 did someone kill him i don't want to run out of things to talk about i want to keep the juices flowing you know we got to keep the juices flowing when we're you know recording videos and things like that man like i just i always want to make sure that you guys are having a good time and you know we can talk about anything and that's why i talk about random things especially when i'm playing the game and stuff like that because whatever you guys are into and if i'm into it too we can all just have like a discussion in the comments and like talk about it or whatever you know i, I don't know what just happened right there i can smell you you can't see me i think i should take the cruise missile off because it's just not it, it, it's just too slow so i think i'm just gonna take it off from now on oh wait 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 you shoot at me you shoot at me wait wait get out of here that's gonna do it for the rainbow tracers hope you guys did enjoy this video if you guys did if you guys don't mind dropping a like subscribe turn on notifications all the good jazz really really appreciate all you guys coming in hanging out with me today thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys later